So New Road Capital currently offers five retail collective investment schemes. The first four are really multi-asset um, portfolios that are designed to take into account different client risk profiles. So we run all of our solutions as fund of fund solutions. So the first um, collective investment scheme that we offer is a multi-asset income solution. This is really designed for the conservative investor and it looks to achieve an inflation plus one and a half percent target over a one year rolling period. The second one up, we move up, so that would be for, for more of a, a moderately conservative investor would be a low equity strategy and really what we're trying to do there is a inflation plus 3% over a rolling three year period. And the same thing, we use underlying building block portfolio managers in order to construct our asset or to, to give us the security selection and then we construct our asset allocation from there. I'm going up then to the moderate investor, it's really a CPI plus four kind of outcome over a five year rolling period. Um, that is for, as I said, the moderately investor and same thing. So we're really using underlying building block portfolios in order to construct our asset allocations. And then the fourth portfolio is a moderately aggressive solution, which would aim as a CPI plus five over a seven year rolling period. So all those portfolios are designed with an outcome in mind. So our portfolios are outcomes focused. Really what we are trying to do there is when we construct our asset allocation modeling, we are saying, okay, well, what do we think different asset classes are gonna do over time period? And then we'll build our asset allocations to achieve those outcomes with the least amount of volatility possible. And thereby taking into account the, the behavioral factors of investing. Um, I'm sure as, as many, many advisors out there will know, as I experienced and many retail clients will know, it's very hard to stay the course um, with many retail investors when the portfolios are too volatile. So we're trying to minimize the volatility but still get a long-term outcome um, that we are trying to achieve. And those outcomes, as I've mentioned, have really are really to, in line with what the advisor is trying to achieve when he risk profiles a client. So all the, those four funds that we offer are designed to be core, either to, to provide a holistic solution to the advisor when he presents to his client. Um, so if the client is moderate, for example, you can just go straight into our moderate fund of funds and it handles the entire asset allocation for you or if not a, a, a holistic allocation, at least a core al asset allocation, and then the advisor can go and take uh, satellite um, allocations into different underlying funds if, they would, if, if, if he, he or she chooses to. Um, finally, the fifth fund is a, is a global flexible mandate, and that fund is really an asset swap fund to uh, get exposure to different offshore asset classes. We still use the building block approach, so we'll go and look at different offshore asset allocations and we'll build our portfolio up that way. And the global flexible fund is really designed to be a offshore allocation in advisors' portfolios, a satellite offshore allocation essentially. The, these four solutions are also all Regulation 28 compliant by design and this allows them to be used in both voluntary and compulsory products.